right here on the clubhouse. And it's all about fruit. Now, to do this puzzle, first you have to pick a puzzle piece, then you have to find the magic shape on the board. This puzzle piece is a banana. My dad is so silly. He likes to pretend the bananas are phones. And the banana shape is right there. This puzzle piece is an orange. When I eat oranges, I like to make orange smiles. And the orange shape is right there. Ooh, this puzzle even has a grape. My mom tells me I'm going to turn into a giant grape if I keep eating so many. And the grape goes right here. Ho, ho. It's Ollie. Hello, Zoe. Ho, ho. Having fun with a fruit puzzle, are you? Yes, I am working on a fruit puzzle and it is so much fun. But it is making me kind of hungry. Fruit is yummy food. It's true. I know someone who needed food too. Listen to this story. Just follow me through. Who? Who? Follow me through. Follow me through. Hello friends, good to see 
you. I'm Luis the Handyman, and today I'm fixing this bread box for my mom. When my mom makes bread, this is where she likes to put it. <laughs> Say, that reminds me of a story. Do you want to help me build it? Great. Hammers up, little builders. Ready? Uno, dos, tres, hammer. Great job, little helpers. You can put your hammers down. Now we just need our story tools. <laughs> yep, we have everything we need. Today's true story from the Bible is about a man named Elijah. Elijah trusted God. He always tried to do what God told him to do, but it hadn't rained in a really long time, and there was no food to eat. God told Elijah to go to a town and find a woman there who had food for him. So Elijah walked to town. Can you stand up and walk in place? Ready? Clip, clop, clip, clop, clip, clop. Good. Okay, you can sit down now. Elijah walked to town and found the woman. Elijah asked her for a little water and a piece of bread. But she said, I only have enough flour and oil to make bread for me and my son, and then I will not have any more. Elijah told the woman, you can make bread and bring it to me, because God said your flour and oil will not run out. So the woman quickly made some bread. She brought it to Elijah, and guess what? The flour and the oil are full again. No matter how much flour and oil she used, she still had more. Wow! Everyone say, God's got it. Ready? God's got it. Just like God said, Elijah, the woman and her son, had food every day because the flour and oil did not run out. <laughs> God's got it. Hey there, Ali. Tell me, who's got it? God's got it. Yes, it's true. Now let's hear it from you. Tell me, who's got it? God's got it. That's the truth, friends. See you next time. So there's your story, and it's all true. Elijah and the woman trusted God, and you can trust God's got it too. Thanks, Ollie. Goodbye to you. Who? Who? Wow, the oil and the flour never ran out. God's got it. I think I've got the story. Did you get it? If you did, say got it. Get it? Got it! Good! I'm going to finish this puzzle now. I'll see you all next time. Bye! Trust in the Lord with all your heart. Proverbs 3, 5. Trust in the Lord with all your heart. Proverbs 3, 5.